Yo, what's happening, YouTube? It's your boy Paul Radio Bad 234 here. Back again with our video as usual. And today we're gonna take a look at some cases for the Samsung Galaxy A10e from Zizzo and Spigen. Watch, let me show you those real quick before we start. So I got the the Zizzo Transform series. And then I got the Spigen Rugged Armor. So let's get started. So one more time with the boxes though. Let's get started, yo. Right, so let's start off with the speaking tough armor. With this guy right here. Or rugged armor, excuse me. I know I said tough armor on the beginning, but rugged armor. I'll make that change in the video, though. But, alright, let's look at the rugged armor. Alright, so, easy pull tab. But, let's read it on the box real quick. You got a form-fitted for device. Ultimate everyday protection. Stable mountain. And then you got... Yeah, these are all the basically the same stuff. And then all your social media platforms. So, alright. One easy pull tab. There we go. Alright, so let's take a look at this. Okay. Take it out of the package. Okay. Now, fresh out of the box, it's got a matte fill to it, which feels good. And then you're speaking browning right there. And then you got this thing right there that kind of looks like carbon fiber, but rumors say that this is not real carbon fiber. This is just a sticker, but it looks awesome though. But just for reference, here's the Poetic uh, Carbon Shield series case. This is real carbon fiber right here. See, look at the difference. They both shine though, definitely shine. So, all right, let's put it on the Samsung Galaxy A10e and see how it looks. All right, just real quick. Here's your camera cutout. And then your buttons, volume up and down rocker buttons, and then your power button, a port, or your little cutout for your headphone jack, and then a cutout for your USB Type-C port, and then your mic and speaker, and then for your mic up there. So, alright, let's put it on the Samsung Galaxy A10e, see how it is? Let me just wipe the back down real fast. Okay. And then let's slap it on. All right, so we're gonna do it like this. Let me wipe down the front as usual. Ah. Trying to get all these dust particles out, you know what I'm saying? Okay, let's slap it on. Let's get one more wipe down real quick. All right. So, this is how it looks in the back. And you're... And your cutouts lined up as you see. And your mic. And then your other mic down there with your speaker grill. Alright, so let's check power button real quick. Okay, that works with no problems. Yep. Alright, let's uh, check the volume up and down real quick. Alright, got my face unlocked. All right, no problems. Turn it down. Turn it up. <laughs> Definitely looks nice, though. Definitely looks nice. But like I said, if you're looking for real carbon fiber, I suggest getting the Poetic Affinity Series case. This is eight bucks on Amazon. But I'll share all the cases that I have for this phone towards the end of the video, though, so I'll tell you all the details. All right, so. One more thing, look, I'm going to go check real quick, so stand by. Oh, yeah, let me get this real quick. Until I space out, but right. I'm going to check charging real quick. Stand by. All right, so let's check charging real quick. I got my USB Type-C right here, and then uh, plug it into the USB Type-C port. So let's see how well works. All right, so... 
hate doing this sometimes. Okay, we got charging on board. But yeah, definitely a nice case though, especially for 11 bucks. But if you want to get real carbon fiber for a really cheap price though, like I said, I'd recommend getting the Poetic Carbon Shield case. But speaking one of the best cases on the market right now. I'll go Samsung and uh, what's it called? Speaking go together. Basically like peanut butter and jelly, like hand in hand, you know? But, all right. Yeah, let's move it over to Zezo. Stand by. All right, so I got one more case from Zizzo. I got the Transform series. Now, this one's going to run you 10 bucks or 11 bucks. And then the Spigen one right there is, uh, no, wait, this is 12 bucks, and then the, this is 11 bucks, so this is like a dollar more. But, all right, let's take a look real quick. It's for designed for the Samsung Galaxy A10e, built for adventure. Not, what was it? Today as well, I did my Zizzo Bolt Series case for the Nokia 3.1 Plus. I get that for all my phones. That's my main case that I use. But this one looks like it has a nice design to it. Come to think of it. In integrated kickstand, shock absorption, secure grip, lifetime warranty, just like the Bolt Series cases. And this is mill STD drop tested. So, Butterfingers, yeah. But. All right, so let's take a look at this. All right, and then you got your, I like that, the little lightning thing, the bolt. And you got your Zizzo thing right here. All right, so we're going to pull this up. Uh, okay. I thought there was going to be, in, like, you know, some circle struggles and shit like that, but I guess not. Ah. You know what? Watch, hold on just a second, y'all. Stand by. All right, it was deep in there, so I had to pull it out. So let's pull this out now. Of course. Alright, so then we're going to take this out. And of course, you got your little thank you card like the Bolt Series one. And then that's pretty much in there. And of course, you got your little card in here. Pull that out as well. Built for adventure. I like that. Alright, so here's the case. This is, this is like rugged protection, good grip, has a matte feel to the case. I like this little pattern right here. And your volume up and down rockers right here. You got your power button. And then your camera cutout right there. You got your cutout for your headphone jack. And then the cutout for your Type-C port. And then for your mic and speaker. And then one for your mic right there. And this is a two-part style case, I think, but let's just make sure. Nah, it's only one part. But, alright, let's slap this on the Samsung Galaxy A10e. See how it looks real quick. Wipe down this real quick. Alright, so, here we go. Okay. Oh. Little drop test, though. Definitely a drop test. Okay, wipe this down. Check this out. Now, this definitely feels great in my hand, dude. Like, honestly, it really feels great. But personally, I go with the Zizzo Bolt Series case. I'm going to get one for this phone, too. I'm going to do that video later, though. Whenever I get it. But yeah, here's your kickstand. Of course, you can watch YouTube videos. Oh, yeah, and then here it is right there. And you, you could have it like in this format and stuff. As you see. And it snaps back into place. Nice. Alright, let's check buttons real quick. Okay, buttons work with no problems. Let me get into focus here. Yeah, buttons work, no problems. Like I said. I like that heartbeat pattern though. And of course, uh, let me do my face unlock. Okay. And let's check volume up and down real fast. Nice clicky buttons. Nice. 
Okay, and all your cutouts lined up as well. Your headphone jack, your USB Type-C, your mic and speaker. And then your speaker right there. But yeah, definitely looks nice though. Especially for 12 bucks. Shit, can't complain. And then this is how it looks in the back. Oop. Logging in shit, man. But yeah, definitely feels good in the hand, dude. All right, one one more thing real quick. Let's check charging. See how it looks. Okay, that works with no problems, of course. And then it's all lined up. And just for the hell of it, let's do this real quick. Let's check charging with the screen on. Okay, that works with no problems. Now let's do the same for the speaking case real quick. Stand by. Before I check the charging real quick, so here's one thing I forgot to clarify. Here's your web pattern inside. That's for your like shock absorption. Of course, all shiny and stuff. And let's check the inside of the Zizzo case real quick. But yeah. And you got your Zizzo branding in there. And then your Zizzo branding on the side. And of course, I already went through the speaking branding. But yeah, I just wanted to clarify those real quick. So let's uh, check the charging real quick uh, on the speaking case with the screen on. All right, so let's check charging one more time. So here's my USB type C. And then here's this uh, port right there. Let's connect that. Okay, the speaking case works with charging on and stuff. It works either way though. All right, I want to talk about a couple more things and then we'll wrap this up. Stand by, yo. Here's a quick review of some of the cases that I have. As far as the on gel skin sleeve case, I don't have that one anymore, but that one goes for 488, so five bucks basically. You could get that at Walmart. Oh, sorry, I was out of focus for a little while, but. And the second one I went with is the Body Glove Gel Skin Case. This one's for your Samsung Galaxy A10e. The price on this one's 15 bucks. And then the third one I got was the Poetic Carbon Shield uh, Series Case. This one's going to run you 8 bucks on Amazon. And then the, the fourth one, I went with the, the Spigen uh, Rugged Armor. And then uh, the Zizzle Transform series case for the fifth one. But basically, as you're seeing right now, these are the only four I have right here. But I'll get me another on gel skin sleeve later on in the future. But this is, you know, in the meantime, you know, all this right there. Oh, yeah. One more thing real quick. Stand by. But yeah, just real quick, though. You can get all these cases on Amazon and stuff, just a reminder. Alright, let's uh, move on real quick. Yeah, so overall, on a scale of 1 to 10, these cases right here are definite A+, of course. You can pick these up on Amazon. Like I said, the prices range from 11 to 12 bucks, basically. But yeah. But, alright. But uh, let me uh, tell you what my favorite one is right now. This one. It's got a nice heavy feel to it. I like this one. And the rugged armor feels pretty good. Even though it's not real carbon fiber. It's just a sticker. Definitely nice though. I like that matte feel. Now that uh, Poetic uh, Carbon Shield series case has that uh, matte feel to it too. So basically this one's a little bit more expensive. Like three or four bucks expensive. Yeah. But yeah, you get the Poetic Carbon Chill case for eight bucks, and then this one's tw 12, 12 bucks or. No way, this is 11. My bad. Get confused with these fucking prices though, dude. But yeah, definitely A plus on both these cases. But. Alright, this has been the double unboxing of the Spigen Rugged Armor case, and then the Zizzle Transform Series case. The cases that I'll have coming up next on the channel, 
is the Zizzle Bolt Series case for the Samsung Galaxy A10e. And then the I found one from Ghost Tech. It's the Covert Series case. I was going to look into doing that one on my channel. And then the OtterBox the Defender Series case. Even though I'm an OtterBox hitter, I'm willing to give that a shot because it's only 30 bucks. so why not? Shout out to OtterBox for making the prices cheaper, though, at least. But anyways, speak and rub it, or, speak and rub it, uh, let me say it one more time, yo. Speak and rugged armor case, and then Zizzle Transform Series case. Hit me up in the comments, let me know what you guys think about this one. But real quick, just a quick channel update, so let's take a look. Yeah, what I have coming up next this week, I got my Fitbit Versa 2 real review, of course. And then uh, we're going to be, uh, and of course, I you could get these uh, little screen protector gel bands and stuff. I already mentioned this on my Zizzle Bolt Series case unboxing for the Nokia 3.1 Plus. But these are going to run you five bucks, of course, protect your screen and stuff. I like that glare to it, though. It definitely blends in. Kind of looks like no panel at all. But yeah, it works though. But yeah, I got my Fitbit Versa 2 real review coming up this week. But yeah, and then you get a set of three. I'll leave that link up in the description as well if you're interested in buying some. But yeah, I like this. So I like that black band. But yeah, I got my Fitbit Versa 2 real review coming up this week and stuff. I'm going to be sharing all the details of that I, I like about this and all that stuff and then some stuff I don't like and stuff but we'll get into that real review though because I've used this all week last week and stuff I like it though so far definitely a nice little upgrade from the Fitbit Blazer but all right now let's wrap this up All right, y'all, so hopefully you guys enjoyed the double unboxing of the Spigen Rugged Armor series case and then the Zizzle Transform series case for the Samsung Galaxy A10e. Like I said, you could buy these on Amazon. Prices are 11 and 12 bucks. So, yeah, and then here they are one more time. But let me see which one I'm going to play out for the day. Um, I'm going to go with the Zizzle. Fuck it. Might as well, you know, let me do a, a quick little thing real fast. Just to let everybody know I'm going to play this one for the day, you know. Sure. Okay, slap these on. Yeah, I like the way this one fills up. So, yeah, I'm going to play play this one for the day. Face unlocks pretty fast, though. <laughs> but, yeah, you got your raised bezels on both of these cases and stuff. But, yeah. Like I said, what I have coming up this week, I got my Fitbit Versa 2 real review coming up. And then uh, I'll take a look at some uh, new headphones to check out and stuff. And then some bands for the Fitbit Versa 2. I've seen some over at Walmart. I'll even order like a Subcase Unicorn Beetle Pro band for that Versa 2. Yeah, I like the way it looks now with that and then screen protected too so I can sleep with this on at night and shit. Hell yeah, yeah. But anyways... Hit me up in the comments, let me know what you guys think about this video, but you know how I do though, I'm Paul Radio Man 2094 follow me or add me on Facebook, I'm under Paul Lyons, and then Instagram is Radio Man 2094 and then my Snapchat is Paul Lyons 20941 and then my uh, TikTok is Paul2094, but yeah, hit me up in the comments as well. Let me know what you guys want me to check out during the week and stuff and and I'll uh, if it's anything like and stuff Anything I could find We'll do that later But we're gonna try to get through a full year by doing all the unboxings and stuff all the gameplays and stuff But yeah, but anyways guys Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what you guys think about these cases, but as usual let me one more time. But as usual, I'm Paul Radio Man 2094. I'm out, yo. Peace out.